Filtering enables you to restrict the data within an information space to find answers to your business questions. This tutorial addresses how to filter data in Explorer for iPad. Note that this tutorial was recorded using SAP Business Objects Explorer for iPad, version 4.0.3. When you're exploring an information space, you can filter the data to look at only the results that interest you. For example, to look at the results for the state of New York only, tap New York in the state facet. A state filter for New York now appears in the Filters panel. The filter means that all the data shown in the facets at the top of the screen and the chart at the bottom now reflects results only for the state of New York. You can apply multiple filters to restrict the available data. For example, apply a filter on the year 2003. Now all the values shown in the facets and the chart reflect the results for New York State for the year 2003. If you'd like to filter on multiple members in a single facet, you can pinch the facet to zoom out and select the members you're interested in. Once you've made your selections, tap the zoom icon to apply your changes. Now delete the last filter applied by tapping the X in its top right corner. You can also filter data by drilling down into the details from within a chart or chart legend. Tap the bar, data point, segment, or legend item you're interested in, and then tap the zoom icon, or the X to cancel your selection. To select multiple members, you can tap multiple items before tapping the zoom icon. Notice that only the selected items are now included in the chart, and a filter specifying those members is added to the filter panel. Another way to filter on multiple items in a chart is to drag to select an area. To clear the selection for an item, tap it. The other items remain selected. Now that you know how to filter data in Explorer, you're ready to sort and rank data.